Hello. First, I apologize for the mess. I apologize for my nails not being done. In fact, two pinkies got really, they're so short, they're ridiculous. My fingernails, if I don't really take excellent care of them, just break. Okay, Planner Society unboxing. I wasn't gonna film this because you know, I just don't have a great setup for filming and then I decided, you know what? I'm gonna do it and try and make it short and sweet because Christy never fails to disappoint and because look at the pom-pom. Can you see that pom-pom? Does it not match the happy planner that I just bought yesterday? Look at that. Isn't that cool? When I say match, I mean the bow is like the same color. I don't know what they call this color, but how cool is that? And I attached it inside on one of the ringy dingies. See that right there? Ooh, it's attached right in there. There you go. And I just flipped it through, you know, that cute way. And just come on the outside. Now, I'm not really a pom-com girl, so I honestly don't know how long this is gonna last. It might not last that long. Um, it's so cutesy and I'm like, you know, eh, not particularly a cutesy kind of senior lady but i just thought for now that looks stinking cute so back in the box that was one of the things that came in this cute little bag right here ah oh, love it love it i'm gonna try and get this up a little bit because i think ah oh, there we go i think that's a little better yes you're gonna see my junk and today i'm bad i'm not having tea but i'm not having soda either okay so the second thing that came was this now to me this is like just an old fashioned put your four by five or whatever pictures in the sleeves, but I know it's not that. The purpose now is to um, put your stickers and we're, some of us have larger sheets of stickers than um, others, depending on the company that we use. And so the Planner Society Scarlet Line Christy is probably trying to accommodate them. It's a little larger than I actually like because I have another bag. I have my gold happy planner bag. It's stuffed. I mean, you can tell it's really, really stuffed. And so I really don't want that big piece, but not to worry, I will find a use for it. So that's that. Okay, for some reason today, I think they didn't give me my stickers, unless they're in here, because I also belong to the sticker, um, the sticker kit. And I don't think they gave them to me, because usually they're sitting right on the top. That's kind of disappointing. I really don't feel like calling them and telling them, or emailing or whatever, and telling them, hey, I need my stickers. Maybe they're in here. Who knows? One time I got washi and stickers, and I don't belong to the washi club kit. Kit club. Okay, I always try to be a little careful. Mm. In case I want to reuse this. I, I think I wrinkled it up too much. But I can always reuse this wonderful, beautiful paper. Oh, and you can feel the paper. You can feel the paper. Woo! Alrighty, there it goes. Yeah, I think they missed. They didn't give me my kit. They did not give me my kit. I might try and contact that because I like the sticker kit. All right, here we go. Look at that beautiful paper. It's gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Try and put this up, get a little bit more like gorgeous. Okay, let's cover up the mess a little bit. All right, here we go. Planner girl. I'm not sure what this is. Let's open it and see. Is it washi tape? Is it? Huh. Oh, I should have. Why didn't I know? So pretty. It's the journaling cards. It's the journal cards. Look at that. Oh, even the, even what it comes in, that can be a journaling card. That's just the, the card with the logo. Whoa. Look at that. Wow. 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 I love today. Keep calm and joyful. Ah, oh, just so gorgeous. I laminate these babies or I just put the holes in them if necessary, whatever planner I'm going with. And I just really, I use the heck out of these. 
Sometimes I just enclose them in a card that I'm sending to someone. Here's our little clip. Oh, is that not cute? I'm not going to take it out, but you can see it's a little fox. And it's got a little blue bow on it. Made by Posh. Poli posh Piece by something. Hmm. Can't read that all the way. Posh. Wow. Posh Pie says me Melissa. Whoa. Okay. Um, I'll read that another time. <laughs> I can't quite make it out. It's got a fun font, but it's too cute. All right. And here's our little ephemera. And I guess because it's fall, foxes abound. They're all trying to get fat, I guess, for the winter. Although fox, fox do not hibernate, but cute ephemera. Um, a little lodge for the happy planner that I'm going to be going into for 2017. But I still am trying to finish up my planner, my large Mombi planner for 2016. I say trying because mm, I've also got a wonderful Naked Cow TN that I've been really enjoying because it's a, it can function as a wallet as well. So Mombi, Big Mombi is not getting, Big Mombi Happy Planner is not getting a whole lot of love. All right. And she always gives us these which are your tabs. I just started using these in my, um, which I don't have here right now, in my um, Naked Cow TN, in one of the books that I actually made, one of the inserts, started to use it. And um, I like it, but it's the first time I'm using them. All right, so those are, you can just individualize them as you see fit. Post-it holder, adorable. I snuck a peek just yesterday because I couldn't wait on Instagram and I saw this. How sweet is that? It's it's a, a wood trunk. Wow, with flowers. Oh, just adorable. I'll use one sheet and then put it away. <laughs> and I also saw these puffy stickers. Not a huge fan of puffy, puffy stickers, but I think Christy felt it had been a while since she put them in and so eh, I'm okay I'll use I'll use them in my large mombi probably not in my small one they're cute lots of people like them and the stamp oops our cute little stamp quite a few little images this time we've got flowers and and um an iced coffee as well as a hot coffee that is stinking cute wow your usual hello more flowers and email a little fox, plan a little, maybe a soup cup. Anyway, that's adorable. I tend to lose these things, so a lot of times they don't get used because I don't want to mess up and lose one. All right, and the pen. I heard someone say online they loved the pen more than they liked their crown pen. Now, I will make a confession here, and people may not like it, I can't stand pen gems. I kind of mentioned this, I think, in a previous unboxing of Planner Society Girl Kit, but I'm going to tell you, I just loathe them. I have a collection because I've been a subscriber to the Planner Society for a year. So I got like six because I think she's, nah, maybe four. I have two other ones that I bought on my own. I don't like the way they feel in my hand. I don't like the way they write. I don't like the, I mean, I'm bashing them. I know it. And um, what can I say? I'm one person. So I'm sure Pen Jibs doesn't care. But I'm, I'm actually hoping that they'll come out. The crystals are wonderful, but can't the crystals go in another kind of a pen? Is that the, is a ballpoint the only kind they can go into? I don't know. But I'd pay if I could see, if I could, feel some I just would like them to try it in another pen I hope they're working on that so here we go this is not a pen gem this is um probably something made in China it doesn't say on the little clip what it is but I'm gonna do a quick little write on a old pen on an old pad it's thin it's not skipping and it goes, of course, with the entire collection, which means oh, it goes with my happy planner. Woo! Whoop, whoop, whoop. Dayas, check that out. Is that not God? Woo! 
So that might just get the little crown from Planner Society back in the day. Whoop, goodbye. And since the Happy Planner has this new leather case, look at that. Look at that. Neat. Neat, 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 neat. I love it. Uh, I think the pom-pom's growing on me. Not much, though. All right. Oh, I'm over 10 minutes. I don't think they're going to give me more than 10 minutes. Two washi tapes. Look at that. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Very fall-themed. And, of course, the one to match the um, paper. Uh, let's see if I can get in here real, 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 real quick. Okay, I messed that up. But I'm not saving the bags as much as I used to. Stickers, but these are not from the sticker kit, so there's only two sheets, so I'm a little unhappy. Um, I'm going to say this, and I don't mean to disparage um, Christy in any way, but there was someone who had a real rant about how her kit was put together, and she actually said, she, someone on YouTube said she'd absolutely never... Um, subscribe to them for a kid again because they were pretty mean when she told them what they had not done. They were nasty to her, just nasty. And we all know that's not necessary at all. And I didn't like hearing it. I don't like hearing stuff like that. But there are two sides to every story. So you know what? I'm going to go ahead and email them and let them know my sticker kit was missing. And I'm going to see what kind of a reaction I get. I will not be upset if they just go, oh well, but I might, at the end of the year, just unsubscribe from the sticker kit. So here's the pretty paper. Pretty, pretty, pretty. And as you notice, one or two of the sheets will match the bags. Woohoo! And look at this. Look at that. Stinking cute. And yo, ah, I hate, I hate those scribble things, but not to worry. I will use these to cover some insert books. Um, she's giving us two now. She has been, I think, for the past three boxes. All right, I better get off here. It's over 12 minutes. Um, subscribe. Try her box. Um, they really are a kit that you really get your money's worth. You really, really do. It's over 30 bucks. People don't like to mention how much things are because prices might go up, but mm, what the heck. Ta-da! My pen's already wrapped up and my uh, being used and um i'm a happy camper all right everybody have a great weekend i don't think i have any more goodies coming in until next month i'm on a very strict budget because my dog required sixteen hundred dollars worth of surgical tooth work uh, i didn't love her so much believe me huh. okay have a good weekend everyone bye